Hey everybody, it's Sunday. It's almost one. Um, supposed to be out of the house by now, but this morning I decided to put the cars back down the bottom of the driveway because they were way at the top. So of course that was a mistake because we couldn't get them back up the driveway because of the ice. So I had to put some salt down and then Pete Nash pushed Ashley's car, which I've lost. Um, because her Chelsea and Kelsey were coming and they were all going to the mall. So you can see, Pete's been out since and um, smashed all the ice. But while I was out there, Naughty Lou, who's here and in the bad books, what did you do? You were a naughty boy, weren't you? He decided that he was going to finish my coffee. Which, fair enough. But in the process of finishing my coffee, he broke my favorite mug. And I do have two of these mugs. And no, there's no point gluing it back together. There's little bits missing. It's all cracked. And uh, he's in the bad books. So we found those at Home Goods, and they only had I found one at one Home Goods and one at the other. So I have one left. He's just lucky it wasn't my blue one, which I just got at Christmas. <laughs> Look at him, he knows he's, we're talking about him. You're a naughty boy. You shouldn't even be allowed on the chair right now. You should be banished to the corner. Couldn't care less, really. But please just getting ready, and then we're going to go to the mall, return Miss Ashley's boots. Yeah, you see it punctured. There's a hole. And the, uh, it's really... This one's rock hard. I'm sure I wore them twice. And this one, you can put your finger almost right through it. So, I don't know. So, hopefully, they won't give us a tough time. She didn't want to return them because she said when anyone returns things in her store, they need the card it was put on and all that. And seeing as it's my debit card and what have you, I will take them. And hopefully get her a new pair. The only thing I'm worried about is they only had two pairs in her size when we bought these. I'm just hoping the other pair is still there, which is a very slim chance. But she said if they don't, she doesn't want any other boots. Just to get the refund and then she'll go look somewhere else. So, And I feel bad because she really loved it. I've worn them two times. And one of the times was to work, standing on her feet for five hours. And the other time was when she went into the city with Chels. All right, guys, we're going to go watch a little YouTube while Pete's getting ready. I'm ready. And uh, I'll talk to you in a bit. Bye, guys. <laughs> we were just about to leave, and I remember we didn't bring the boots, which is the whole reason for us going to this mall. So Pete went in, but he always sighs at me. Do your spouses sigh? I, I, I'm always in trouble, I feel like. I go, oh, I forgot the boots. <sighs> I said, they're on the kitchen table. So I go, I'll go, and I'll go. Sorry. No problem. <laughs> he's, no problem now, he's on film. No problem. Yeah, I right. noticed he didn't walk out with a video. No. All right, we'll see you guys in a bit. Bye. It's Christmas all over again. It's packed solid. Yeah. And then Ash is here somewhere with her buddies. We're in Dave and Buster's, aren't we? Who are you? Um, yep. Pete's emailing seniors. Uh, Never ends work, does it? No. Ashley's in the game room with Chelsea. We bumped into them. But we decided to sit away from them on our own. Didn't we? Yes. And I found the mini candle, not the mini, the medium candle in the sparkling icicles. Just kidding. <laughs> He's been a good spot. Yeah. Oh, and they didn't have Ashley's boots, so we have to go. They have them actually in our town. So on the way home, we get to go to that shoe store. This is the best sandwich to get you eating. They've now opened this. I couldn't do that. How many floors up is that? Four? Four, yeah. Was it 
just for fun? Yeah. Is it fun? <laughs> I guess. Not for me. It's Pete's favorite store over there in the corner. It's Kvorsk, Savorsky. Oh, you like Savorsky? Yeah. Savor I can't even say it in Sephora. Sasha's. That's it, I meant Savora. This place was absolutely mobbed and there's people coming in. Streams and streams of people. Ash is still in there, we're leaving her behind. Bumped into them Left a couple of times. Left her to fend for herself. Huh? Left her to fend for herself. She can walk her. I gave this lady our spot. I was very nice, I told her where we were going. She's probably going score, like we did. But, yes, was, I don't know, wasn't this bad when we came in for Christmas? No. It's crazy. But we don't know what we missed, because we didn't see any huge sales, did we? We had a good lunch. Yes, very good, thank you. And we had, got a couple of candles, smaller ones, but that's okay. And I got my creme brulee coffee, which was awesome. Got three boxes. And a Union Jack pillow. Caught my eye. Yeah. And the lady let me use five, four coupons, so that was even better. It's taken us 10 minutes just to get around from the other side of the mall, and it, look over here. Madness. It's not even like there may be some parking spaces because of snow. No, that's true. It is crazy. Everyone, it's six o'clock, just got home. Um, I found, like I told you, it's this size though. Put it over this side so you can see it. A mini sparkling ice cores. As you can see, it's a uh, no, I was going to say half the size, not even half the size, like quarter the size, but I'll save that one. Earring stuck on my sweater, don't you love that? Um, so I got that, I got two, one for Ash, one for me. And then I got this, um, these are Ashley's over here, I put mine away. I got the Christmas barn, sorry, the white Christmas barn, that one smells really good too. Bath, bed, bath and beyond and found my creme brulee coffee which I'm dead excited about so I got three boxes this time because they don't have it in the the one now. Oh, and then I got my lighters for my candles which made me happy because I hate using the matches because when you do the matches the ends seem to pop off and go into the candle and it's awful whereas we're running out I spied these little pillows so as soon as I had my coupon I had a 20% off coupon and there was only a couple and Picos get it because as you know um, if you don't get it when you see it it's not there when you get back and they only had like four of them and I don't think I'll be going to this mall anytime soon so I went and I picked that up they had American ones and then they had this and I said to Pete um, I'll check the one by us and if they have any more I'm gonna get a couple for downstairs proud Brit the real Brits in New York right gotta have my British stuff around me and as you saw, Louis broke my mug this morning and I can't find a replacement. Oh, he just looked at me like, I'm sorry, let it go already. But um, I'm having a nice cup of creme brulee coffee right now. I'm going to watch videos. Ash is still at the mall with her two buddies. It's so cold and windy. Oh, and when we got to the shoe store to uh, replace Ashley's shoes, they didn't have any of those boots left at all. Not her size, not brown, not black, not that style whatsoever. So the girl goes, I can call, I can check somewhere online for you. She goes and see if anybody has them. So I'm like, brilliant, thank you. So she checks. She goes, Monroe has them, which is up the line a bit. And then our town had them. The one five minutes from my house had her shoes, her boots. So she said, just take the boots in and replace them. So we just go over there on the way home because they close at six and the girl was keeping them behind the counter for me and her name happened to be Ashley. So I go in and she said, oh, why did you bring the boots with you? She said you were supposed to leave the boots there. She was going to take, you know, give you a credit and then just come in here and buy them. And I said, oh, well, she didn't. She told me just to bring the boots here. So that's what I did. But they didn't even exchange for me. The reason being I used a coupon I had. Um, you know, with the rewards program, I'd used a, I think it was a 20% off coupon, so it was like another $10 off the boots. 
but I ended up getting 48 cents back because of the tax difference between there and here but the two um, girls in the store were kind of mumbling against each other I guess they weren't happy that the fact that now they have to take these boots in with a broken heel but um, anyway it's done I apologized I said I'm sorry that's kind of what she told me to do and she goes it's not your fault she said but she should have taken the boots in and then you could have just bought them outright how many times can I say boots in a conversation I hate that word too I don't like the ooh sound <laughs> boots I think it's because Pete says it he always puts the emphasis on it boots moon anyway <laughs> it's so dumb that's me dumb not him dumb but anyway we're home now Louis's happy, Roxy's downstairs. Didn't spend much money at all, I love it. We went out and had that lunch. I've got half my sandwich for later on. It was really, really good. And now I'm just gonna chill out till Miss Ashley gets out. Got my candle going. That's the one Ash bought me, the frosted cranberry. That's really nice too. But there was two Bath and Body Works in this place. One didn't have any Christmas ones at all. Like you said, Stacy, just all the summery ones. No one has the London call-in anymore either. Even though I found out I am the only one that likes that smell out of everybody. Pete hates it, Ash hates it, Sherry hates it. Um, Ashley, I bumped into Ash in the mall and I guess Chelsea had smelt it and she didn't like it either. So um, I think I must be the only person. Maybe because it smells like tea and... What was it? Tea and lemon, I think. So I was going to get one today and neither of these stores had any. So, I just think it's funny I'm the only one that likes it. Yeah, there's two of these Bath and Body Works in this mall. I don't know why. So we went down to the second one and they had a bunch more Christmas ones. But they had a lot of the winter ones and a lot of the fireside. And I've had two of the winter ones and I'm kind of over that one now. And I want to go on to the next. But I have this one burning, now I have the little one and then I have two other big ones. And then when I find this London calling one, I'm going to get a couple of those as well. Alrighty, on that note, I'm going to love and leave you. I will... Don't probably won't be back tonight because I don't think anything exciting is going to happen tonight. Just going to chill out now, finish my coffee, hug Louie because he looks sad. And tomorrow's New Year's Eve, last day of 2012. Hope you've all got big plans for the new year. But everybody I've asked so far is doing what we're doing and just staying home and chilling out. So we have New Year's Eve Monday. We have New Year's Day Tuesday. Oh, we didn't get to see Pete's dad tonight because we had to come back to our area to get the boots. And then rather than run back over, if he's exhausted at the end of the day, we're going to take a ride over tomorrow. Ash has to work tomorrow. And then New Year's Day on Tuesday and then Peter's birthday on Wednesday the big 5-0 and we're not doing anything because he doesn't want to do anything Wednesday but uh, maybe over the weekend and then not that he watches the vlogs Dodie his sister and I are planning something for later on in the month probably around Super Bowl Sunday so he doesn't know it's for him but we're going to try and have a little get together for him get hold of some of his buddies and that wind is whipping so I'm going to go chill out bye guys have a good night